Hey, what's up? My name is John. I'm building an open source tool called Red, Yellow, Green. And in the next minute and a half, I'll tell you what I've done so far and what I'm planning to do in my upcoming stream. I'll be streaming as soon as later today. So please follow the page and also check out my YouTube. Red, Yellow, Green is a social quality content analysis tool and I'm building it for two reasons. One, as a content creator, I wanna make sure that I'm building high quality content. Two, I'm trying to write a book and it might sound like, why are you building this social thing to write a book? Well, the answer is because I want an AI to write the book for me. And I want that AI to be trained on high quality data. So I teach people how to code in my social media and I don't have time to like update the book like every month, but I make social media posts every month. So I can have an AI that watches the green stuff basically and automatically write the book and keep it up to date. So here's what the website looks like currently. That's basically a boilerplate website where you can log in. When you log in pretty much right now, you can see a list of TikToks and their URLs and their titles. The code repository also includes a data scraper that is scraping a bunch of TikTok information as well as YouTube information that is associated together through repurpose.io. So as a content creator, I'll post like a short video on TikTok and repurpose.io will take it and send it to YouTube shorts, Instagram reels, and a bunch of these like short form video places. So repurpose.io is this central hub that actually connects all of them together. And so I can have this scraper that scrapes repurpose.io and I can basically correlate, here's the same video on TikTok as on Instagram, and I can see the channel differences. And that's one of the things that's really important about this tool. So I live code and I stream this and I save the playlist on YouTube. We're currently on part five. Here's my agenda for part five. More scraping, let's get to the insights, count of views, likes, comments per video, video age and days, stability score and circulation candidate identification. A circulation candidate is a piece of content that meets three criteria. It performed really well. It's non-recent and it is still relevant. So if a piece of content meets all those criteria, I might want to post it again. And I think that this is a really cool feature that I don't see a lot of other social media tools providing is circulation candidate identification. So I'm hoping to work on that today and I hope you'll like follow along and um, stay tuned because this is just like part five, like we're really just getting started. There's gonna be a bunch more cool stuff in the future.